Okay guys, in that lecture we can talk about the 3D model process again. So I'm gonna create Neohukum process with an hydrolysis properties. So I created my 3D model. After that I'm creating some material here. I used and hyperelastic properties here as a material behaviors. After that of course I created hydrolysis properties by using the sub options here and you click the sub options you can see the some parameters here I'm writing 0 0.95 4 and minus 1 okay after that when I turn back to the step process I need to create some basic stuff here it is um, 60 second with Nehum it's on after that I can turn back to the incremental process I created my maximum number of incremental is a hundred this is my initial condition and 0 0.5 and as a maximum position 0 0.5 when i multiply with 100 with 0 0.5 i can get and 50. so after that i can turn back to the mesh element in that case i use the 3d stress here with hyper formulation after that i can turn back to the load options here and i created some boundary condition here as an ancestre and i can also use the some displacement rotation minus 25 millimeter okay of course in that case we can use the and um, amplify here i'm pushing that button to organize and amplitude properties here it's a time and aptitude zero and time and aptitude and 0 0.5 millimeters after that when i and click on the aptitude plotter i can see the that's kind of result here okay okay end of the section of course i can create my job and i can simulate it i need to see the 100 steps here after that of course i can and get my visualization section so i can easily turn back to and abacus here and end of that section you can see the sum and load section here like this okay thank you very much for listening to me i really appreciated your interest